Good day, citizens of Trinidad and Tobago. I am Robert Amaro, President of the National Democrats, a new political organization that has become, I would say, the answer for the problems of this country. For too long, the citizens of this country has been asked to choose between one or the other. And on every occasion, the answers that derive equals failure. It's a continuum. It's the same story over and over. One side saying the other side is dishonest. The other side saying the other side has no ability to manage. And in the end, where are you, the citizen? You are in limbo. For too long, the cry, the call, has been for a new political organization. I am pleased to introduce to you the National Democrats. This is an organization that has been in formation for quite a number of years. And we have never really come to you to ask for your support. Except 10 years ago, when I participated in the national elections in Laventille, and I lost. But so did that community. Because the person who was put up against me neither had the capacity nor the skill to do what I could have done for you, the citizen of Laventille. Years later, you remain the same. You are no better off. The issues and problems in your constituency has either gotten worse, has either gotten worse, or has been left in the same abandoned way for the last 40 years. Roads, pavements, canals, schools, projects, housing projects, playgrounds, all of those things. They are either the same way you know them or very little improvement. This organization for which I am proud to lead is called the National Democrats. We have taken some time to put together our symbol to be representative of the people of this country. Lots of time was taken to establish a symbol that would represent each and every one. And the drums are the symbol that the National Democrats is grounded as we move forward. Drums, because this has been the way communication occurred from time immemorial. And today, drums still play a very vital role in anything we do. In this symbol, we have included the drums of the African descendants, the Indian descendants, and we have also included the pan, the Trinbegonian. And a Trinbegonian is anyone who was born in Trinidad and Tobago after independence, if you want to consider that to be the beacon or the datum line for measurement. But this symbol also has in it one of the rings, the outer ring, which is gray, that represents the constitution. The first inside ring, black, that represents the people. The innermost circle, red, that represents the 41 nationals who are elected by you, the citizens, to represent this great nation. And in the center, the most important part of the representation, local government, 
the local government councils are included in the middle because it is from local government that governance really should take place. Power back to the people? Yes. But that power back to the people can only occur when you take responsibility. We are asking you to consider our candidates. St. Anne's River North, Belmont, North and West, and Woodbrook. And we are saying to you, give us the authority that on November the 28th, after you have decided what is in the best interest, that you have three councillors of the National Democrats sitting in the council, making those others do their jobs. If you put the council with everyone who is of the same, who is guarding the guards? I have a reputation for being very thorough. But let me emphasize that that repetition does not come without error. I'm not infallible. But what I am is honest, just, and capable. And if you give my team the opportunity to serve you, when the time has arrived for you to reference our success, you will be saying, I am proud to have taken the initiative to give the National Democrats the opportunity to show what can be done and to prove that what has been done, others have failed. I do not come to this political forum for anything, for I have had everything in my life that I need. I think the missing link is to serve you, the citizens of Trinidad and Tobago. And it is with that intention that I again call upon you, the citizens, to give the National Democrats candidates the chance to work in the community and to show you that we can make a difference. We are not asking for change. We are not asking to be in charge. We are asking to be there to look after your interests. And therefore, we hope that on the 28th, when you go to the boots and you cast your vote, you will put your X by the drums. The symbol of the National Democrats, the symbol of the organization for which I am proud to lead and for which you will be proud you have given the opportunity. I bid you a good evening and thank you.